Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For you, those of you that subscribe, thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Uh, for those that haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Uh, I want to do a video about having the Tesla Model 3 performance after two years, two year birthday for this car. Um, I didn't get the protective shell for the car. A lot of people did. I was recommended that I should. Kind of wish I did uh, with normal driving. It, it does have some scratches now, scuff marks. I did try to fix some with the paint that they uh, that you can order from Tesla. Um, yeah, there's some nicks, and may, maybe for the two-year birthday after, I will get those fixed and get the protective shell. It, at the time, it was about five thousand dollars for that option, which I thought I didn't really need, but probably should have gotten to protect the paint better. Um, after two years, do I still love this car? Yes. Um, I have about 38,000 miles on it already over two years. Uh, some concerns I heard about the car were the tires wear out really fast. Um, these tires are still good. I mean, very good. And I don't drive it like grandma. I, I drive this car pretty aggressive. And the tires are still very good. Um, the car is still up to date. Uh, it's always getting software updates. It's clean inside. I have a couple scuff marks on the seats. People get concerned about having the white seats. Um, there is marks. Um, I did sit down on something and got a scuff mark here. All in all, the seats are still in good condition, um, even being white. If it wasn't for the wife doing 90% of the cleaning on this car, the deep cleaning, um, it'd probably be more regrettable, but she really does a phenomenal job of keeping this car clean for me. Everybody that gets in loves it. Um, there's nothing like getting in this car when it's cold and the seats are warm. The cabin is up to temperature. Uh, I'm always getting comments about the car. Everybody loves it. It's just never going to go out of style. And, and it just keeps getting better. It keeps getting better. Um, the only flaws I would say that I'm not crazy about is looking through the rear view mirror. I still have a hard time because I can only see about half in the mirror of the road and the other half I only can see uh, the back seat. So that part I'm not too too happy about but uh, that's okay. Would I, would I change this car for another car? No way. Now that I have a, have a Tesla uh, the, there is no way of going back to this, uh, going back to another ICE car. I see ice car parts all over the road when I'm driving, mufflers and pieces, parts. This, this, I don't see anything falling off. Um, one upgrade I did do to this car is the interior lights come with a standard white lighting um, around here, underneath the feet, where the feet are, and underneath the puddle lights are come with standard white lights, which are really dim. I did upgrade these to LED lights super simple each one takes probably two minutes to pop in with a little screwdriver i think i changed eight of them or nine of them and and they're blue and it matches the car at night it's a phenomenal look i'll try to remember to open it tonight and take a picture with the doors open the trunk open it really adds a lot of uh, value to the look of the car for a small price each one of those lights was probably I don't know, 10 bucks or something like that. So for under $100, it really adds a lot. And you can get whatever, red, you can get whatever color you want to match your car. Um, they're not from Tesla, it's from a third party. I can leave a link in the channel comments about how to get that. Am I super happy with this car after two years? Yes. Not because I work there, not because of any other reason. I never had a car like this and I don't think I'll ever go back to an ICE car. They're constantly updating the software and the car just keeps getting better. I don't hear rattles, I don't hear noises. I, I just love the feel and everything about this car. I wouldn't switch it for anything. So if you're on the fence about getting a Tesla car, uh, if you can, just, just pop for the money. I know they keep making them more affordable. They're trying to make them more affordable. If you can spend the extra money to get one, I would highly recommend it. <laughs> Enjoy it if you get one. So kind of a fun thing about the car is you can name your vehicle when you pick it up brand new. You can call it whatever if you want to call it Honey Bunny or you want to call it Lightning or whatever. Mine happens to be called uh, the Blue Bullet. 
I liked that name from the moment I sat down in it. And I was like, it's blue, it's fast. What's a better name than the Blue Bullet? It is, uh, and you can you can change that name. You got it right here if you can zoom in. Uh, right there it says Blue Bullet, but you can change that anytime uh, to suit whatever you want to call your car, the Destroyer, the Rocket, whatever. Um, Driving Miss Daisy, whatever name you'd like, you can change it to a name that you like. But for me, Blue Bullet seems fitting for this particular car. Um, software keeps getting better. They're always coming out with updates, um, stuff to amuse yourself with uh, emission control or with the light display or light show. It's, there's, there's no other cars out there that, that has over the air updates that work like this flawlessly, making the car continuously getting better and better and better. Uh, I can't say enough about it. It is, it is an awesome car. Everybody that gets in loves it. Hey guys, another addition I did to the car basically was replace the mats, the original Tesla mats it came with. You got these heavy duty Tesla all weather mats. Um, yeah, they're a little bit pricey, but it, it really protects the floor underneath, it keeps it pretty much brand new. And if you're in an area with heavy rain or snow or something like that, these are great. You could just take them out if it's full of snow, dump them, wipe it down or whatever and put it back and it protects your car a lot better than the mats that come with the car. Those, those will get destroyed with snow and sand and that kind of stuff very quickly. I will put a link in the comments on this also. So if you're interested in picking those up for your car, you can get them. Of course, it'll be for the Model 3. Thanks, guys.